This is a follow-up video for the spherical scissors to provide more explanations. With this picture, it is easier to understand the distance and height described in the previous video. With a particular angle A, the distance and height can be calculated by sine and cosine. As the bar is curved, the radius at the top is smaller than 39 mm, so with the height, the radius can be calculated. By radius and the distance, angle B can be determined. Angle B is equal to angle C, no matter what number of count or the position of the bar. For a particular number of count, I can find out the maximum angle for the spacing. For this example, it is 45 degrees. If the spacing is more than that, the bar will overlap. I hope the explanation is key enough. Thank you for watching.